Hi, I'm George Little and we're going to look at the brand new 2016 386 Excursion from Stratus. It's an amazing hull shot with this new G2. But the performance of the hull, regardless of your horsepower, 150 or 200, is going to be very, very similar. This is a truly a multi-purpose, multi-species boat. We'll start up here and show you that we have built a panel large enough to put an 859 or an 8 inch unit right here in the dash flush mounted of course you can put any kind of gimbal or ram that you would like uh, there also stainless steel cup holder can't have enough cup holders and then on all stratus uh, models comes with a Minn Kota trolling motor as standard we've got the front of the boat set up here in the what i kind of call a family package with the cushions but under the cushions are all the cabinets your live wells and everything you need to make it a fishing boat. I'm gonna take our cushions out of the front, out of the rails, and they also have snaps that you can hold them down to the, uh, the carpeted lid so they don't blow out. And then, this is your aluminum deck extension. And it very easily installs, line it up, drop it in. Now you have a full-blown fishing deck here in the front of the boat. You have a carpeted storage box here with the rubber seal to help keep everything dry. Stainless steel latches. And here's your, your front bait well, front live well. Uh, fiberglass box, once again, weather strip. Another carpeted storage box. Lots of storage in the front of the boat. And your cooler. Now the rod locker in this boat is extraordinary. You can see how much space we've got. This is a fishing package, and I, and I mean that the excursion has a family package or a fishing package that you can get. We're showing the fishing package that you get five extra tubes right there in the center of the rod locker. If you didn't have that, you'd have a space where you could put your skis, your wakeboards, whatever. Lots of room. Something else I wanted to show you is you, the deck extension, when it's in place, does not get in the way of accessing the rod locker. That's a really big deal. We have snap-in carpet. So if you want to take this out and wash the boat out, if you're using live bait or the boat just gets dirty, you can pull the carpet out, simply wash it out. Makes it very easy cleanup. You can flush mount a unit right here at the helm. We've got a tilt wheel, which is an option, and all your gauges are right here at eye level. So when you're looking forward, everything is, is where you need it to be. If you wanted to add even a second unit, we can ram mount and put another one right here. All your toggle switches are right here where they need to be. And here we have a G2 engine on it, and you've got your 3.5 uh, multi-purpose gauge right there. So everything has been designed so it's very, very user friendly and lots and lots of leg room. This is something new, is the accessibility to the pumps. We've made it so it's very, very easy if you ever had an issue with a live well pump or an aerator pump to, to get to it without having to move a battery or something like that. Jump seats. Jump seats are a big part of the 386. We have them up here so if you had extra people over for the weekend um, you can carry six people in this boat with no issues at all everybody will have their own seat if you're using it for a fishing uh, application simply lay it down and you've got a carpeted deck now i'm showing the ski pole another option on the boat uh, that we have in this boat it simply is a one piece aluminum pole that slides in, 
you'll have to lock it in the bottom of the boat so it won't pull out but we're not using the tripod system it's just a single aluminum pole makes it uh, very very easy to store when you're not using it and very easy to apply or put in place when you do need it now the live well our stainless steel latch opens it up to over a 30 inch live well that we put in the boat that is a big improvement over the old 386 and remember with stratus you have your choice of power you can put any brand of engine you want on your boat we've chose the uh, new g2 200 on this one it performs amazing a couple of things is this boat the 18 and a half foot you can put a 200 on this uh, if you're going to do a lot of skiing i probably recommend it but you don't really need it. It works great with a 150. A 150 HO Everroot on this boat will still run close to 50 miles an hour. So that's another thing with the Excursion brand is you can put whatever engine you want on it. If you want to see more about this boat or any Stratus boat, go to stratusboats.com.